Oh, this is the Tyrrell of Mark Blundell. The camera being mounted inside the helmet. So this is the view the driver has. Checking his mirrors there. And Mark on that long straight up to Lacombe. And he went off that dry line jump just to cool the tyres down a bit. Yeah, the, the, the circuit parts of it are becoming very dry. And of course, on the high speed parts of the circuit, you want to keep the tyres as cool as possible. So pulled over to the right, used the wet part of the straight, then as he came into the braking zone, then back across onto the left. And uh, well, that again is just tough teammate, Okio Katayama. And there's the helmet view. Well, an interesting perspective. This is pretty much how it is for the driver. And in fact, the quality of these pictures today, very good. And Mark Blundell, maybe because it is wet, his head isn't moving around quite as much as we saw yesterday. And you can see just how much a driver tilts his head into the corner. It's part of driving. It's something that you see, with, for example, with John Alesi, his head virtually touches the cockpit sides of his Ferrari when he's turning into a corner. All the way down through Puho. You pick up the throttle shortly after the apex. And now what we saw happen on Friday afternoon, the beginnings of a line appearing, but really much too late in the proceedings now to have any effect on the, the final outcome of the grid. And still no sign of either Jordan on the track. <laughs> 